Welcome, the Empress of Tomorrow. Making her way to the ring from Osaka, Japan, Asuka. Asuka, absolutely incredible with what she has accomplished in such a short time here. Well on her way to becoming one of the best ever. A great champion at NXT. A sole survivor at Survivor Series. The winner of the first ever Women's Royal Rumble match. What a start to her career for Asuka. Oh, my God. Calm down. And her opponents. First, from Yorktown Heights, New York, Mandy Rose. Camera guys really need to focus on getting their cameras better. This thing is so blurry, making my eyes water. Nothing else matters right now, Byron. Mandy Rose, a success story from toughen up former bodybuilding and fitness champion. One of the most beautiful women to ever grace WWE. Are you okay over there, Corey? Don't ruin this, Byron. A true star, no doubt about it. They're on their feet! For Mickey! And from Richmond, Virginia, Mickey James! A six-time champion. I sometimes question the fact that she's friends with Alexa Bliss. But despite that fact, she's a legend. Cole, it sounds to me like maybe you're a little bit jealous that Mickey gets to spend time with the goddess and you're not even allowed to look in her general direction. Maybe. You too, Michael? Mickey James, uh, also a talented country singer. Mickey James, talented in the ring, talented behind the microphone. Byron, one of these days you'll find something you're good at in life. It's Bailey! Give me a hug, man. No! And from San Jose, California, Bailey! Guys, they're here! The wacky, wavy, inflatable arm flailing Bailey buddies! Ha <laughs> ha, my night is made! Well, Byron, relationships are all about ratios. Maybe you'll get a date with one of them finally. Huh? Ladies and gentlemen, this is a Falls Count Anywhere match, which means this contest can end anywhere inside this arena. And let me tell you that a match of this nature is incredibly dangerous, especially considering how many different weapons a superstar can find throughout the arena. It's just an infectious feeling when Bailey comes to town, when Bailey competes. Everybody's feeling hug life, except Corey.
Here we go, guys. Falls wow. count anywhere. And Cole, I will be shocked if we don't see this one spill out to the arena floor sooner rather than later. Oh. Setting up for it. Oh my God, what an elbow. Oh, breakneck speed, one of her karana. Oh, that's one way to bring it to her opponent, big time. Look at this, boom, nice. You gotta believe this one's over. I've made it quite clear how offensive I find Bailey's hugs, but I will admit the Bailey to Belly suplex will take you right out of your boots. And it's Asuka making a move. It doesn't look like she's going to get her to tap here. And she escapes the submission. Not a lot of people can break out of that one, Michael. It's perfect that Bailey's big move, the Bailey to Bailey, shows just how precise and powerful Bailey can be. When the hugger plants the opposition with her twist on a classic suplex, it's all over. I remember when Bailey gave Nia Jax a super Bailey to Bailey on the middle rope in NXT, and when Bailey was on Team Raw, the 2016 Survivor Series, the Bailey to Bailey on Becky Lynch sealed the victory for the team. Hugs all around. The Fatal 4-Way match works like this. Four superstars are in the ring all at once. There are no count-outs and no disqualifications. You have four superstars who are throwing down in the ring all at the same time, and they can fight anywhere they want to. It's mass hysteria. And Asuka was able to get out of the way there. Close line! And she's knocked off her feet. I think that one caught her by surprise, Michael. In describing this match, Corey, you said it can end anywhere, which means we could see this match conclude in the ring, the stands, the locker room. Heck, it could even end outside the streets. And on top of that, it's worth noting that anything is legal in this match, guys. The only rule is there are no rules. Well, guys, the referee should have it relatively easy here tonight because, as you know, in a false count anywhere match, anything goes. Done. She is on fire. Michael, you brought this up earlier, but just think of the possibilities in terms of matchups in a fatal four-way. At any point, a super uh oh Here we go. Here we go. Whoa, it's another reversal. I don't think I've ever seen anything quite like that. She gets out of it. She has renewed life now, Michael. Oh, oh man, man, she's rolling now. Yet another counter. It's like a nail. This is all. Oh, oh, it's over. This is exactly what Asuka was waiting. Here's the cover. Oh, kick out. She came here to fight, not lay down. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. Here we go. Back inside the ring. And we could see a tap out. It's locked in. But can she follow up? Backbreaker. That'll realign your vertebrae. And it's Mickey James making a move. Oh, spiking Diddy T. Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. I can't believe it. Here comes Bailey. I don't think this is going to do it. Amazingly, she works her way free. Cole, there may be no beating her here tonight. Incredible impact. 
Double underhook applied. Harsh impact. Nice. Shut it down. With just some great execution right there. Nobody wants to face Asuka when she's rolling. It's a very Shot to the back. Soften him up. Oh, this, this could be dangerous. This could hurt. Oh, oh my God. Oh, what oh. a German suplex. Unreal. Oh, there's a kick to the midsection. Here we go. Oh, sliding hip attack. Oh, man. Bailey's going to... Can she keep her down? Oh, ouch. The resolve this woman is showing right now is absolutely unreal. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. A move like that can get her right back into this match. Immediately. Now this one's all but over. It's locked in. The Oscar lock. Uh-oh. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Nope. She releases it. Well, that decision may very well come back to haunt her, Cole. Vertical suplex. She goes for the cover. The referee goes down hard. What a win. Double axe handle smash. And there's the breakup. Just in the nick of time. No reverses it. She's flipped the switch and the light is on. Oh, and she gets floored by that one. Yeah, there's no staying on your feet after something like that. With a Bailey Plex. That might have done it, Cole. Suplex. Oh, here it comes. Bailey, Bailey to belly. Wow, what a gritty performance. Oh, here it comes. Bailey, Bailey to belly. Bailey can end it here. Bailey is real. She goes for the cover. One. Two, three. Bailey scores the victory. Well, it wasn't literally fatal, but it was pretty close. Take a look. Look at her go. She's taking care of business. Man, this was great. And if you don't enjoy watching her perform, there's something seriously wrong with you. Here is your winner, Bailey. And there's your winner via pinfall. That was four competitors giving it their absolute best in there. Unfortunately, though, only one can walk away with the win. I think I can safely speak for all of us when I say that was an amazing contest. woman to ever capture the SmackDown and Raw Women's Championships, Alexa Bliss, the goddess of WWE. The irresistible force And her opponents, first, from San Diego, California, Maya Jax. Hey, whenever Nia Jax enters an arena, whenever Nia Jax enters a match, everyone takes notice of the dominance that this woman is capable of. She's beautiful, she's powerful, she's dangerous. It's like a million dollar smile on a wrecking ball. Nia Jax is the irresistible.
Oh, yeah. Ever so dangerous. And from Dallas, Texas, Ember. And Byron, remember, falls count anywhere in this match here tonight. Which means there's a good chance we'll be relying on our monitors because there's no doubt in my mind that the action will spill into all corners of the arena. We've seen some heartbreaking betrayals in WWE over the years, but Alexa Bliss insulting Nia Jax may be one of the most heartbreaking things we've ever seen. Yeah, you got that right, Michael. Nia Jax had Alexa Bliss's back ever since Bliss joined the Raw roster. They even had a seemingly stable friendship. But when Alexa thought the cameras were off, the world learned what Little Miss Bliss truly thought of Nia Jax. And Cole, I will be oh, wow. shocked if we don't see this one spill out to the arena floor sooner rather than later. Look out. There she goes. Some superstars who cover here. And Nia Jax quickly kicks out. She's still in this one. Oh, man. Right to the R. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, nasty impact. Boom! <laughs> here she goes. Back in the ring now. As Byron mentioned, anything goes in this one, which means we're likely to see a liberal use of weaponry here tonight. Yeah, keep in mind, Cole, the fact that there's no disqualification also means that anybody can interfere and there's nothing you can do about it. Assault on the lower back. Side rush and leg sweep. Oh, ho, ho, perfect form. Nia Jax seems to have lost a step now. Well, here's what we're going to see what she's made of. It's been an amazing match up to this point, guys. And from where I sit, any one of these women can win this thing. You know, I'd say the Falls Count Anywhere match was popularized back in the Attitude Era. But before that, I remember Pat Patterson and Sergeant Slaughter's famous 1981 Alley fight, which many consider to be the precursor to Falls Count Anywhere. Uh, setting him up. Ooh, that might have just broken something. As Byron mentioned, the Pat Patterson Sergeant Slaughter Alley fight had many of the elements of a Falls Count Anywhere match. Most notably, I'd say, was the heavy weapon usage. Yeah, that match had everything from cowboy boots to brass knuckles, but more importantly, weren't you born in 1981, Saxton? Good point. Ooh! This might be it! Oh, my! And she's knocked off her feet. I think that one caught her by surprise, Michael. Nia Jackson. Oh, Nia Jackson, a leg drop! Thunderous leg drop! This could be it, guys. Now, can Nia Jax make the most of this? Oh, man! That looks like it hurts. She got all of it there. Now, can Nia Jax... You're not gonna get her that easy. She's still in this one. Goodness, that hurt the shoulder. What is Alexa Melissa's best strategy at this point? She's gonna have to turn things around. You're not going to win any matches that easily. Too soon. She got her with a reversal. She is on fire. Will this be enough? And she kicks out with 
relative ease. Too yeah. soon. When it comes to falls count anywhere matches, for my money, there are few better than the November 2016 battle between Charlotte Flair and Sasha Banks. Shoulders on the back. And there's the kick out. She's more durable than she looks, guys. Speaking of that classic Charlotte-Sasha encounter Corey mentioned, we should add that it was the first time ever that the women's championship changed hands in a Falls Count Anywhere match. And guys, I will never forget the image of Charlotte tapping out to that unique bank statement in the crowd surrounded by the WWE Universe. Oof. Insult to injury! Man, she knows how to make a comeback. Jeez, I don't like Ember Moon's chance at this may very well be it. Digging deep for a kick out. She's still in this one. Alexa Bliss is in position. Oh, Alexa Bliss may have it. Oh, what impact. Wow, she's fought her. She goes for the cover. Well, she's got a tremendous amount of resilience, so I think she's got some something left here. Uh-uh. Oh, drop kick to the back. a pin attempt. One! And Alexa Bliss gets out of the pinfall. Alexa's not the biggest, but she's definitely one of the toughest. She's not careful. Things can get out of control in a hurry. Uh, I think they're about to. They can't walk after that attack to the back. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top rope. She's got that gleam in her eyes. Oof! She's got her. Here's Nia Jax, not letting up on her. She goes for the cover. Two! She got the shoulder up in time. I can't believe she kicked out there. Nia Jax sees an opening. Beautiful swinging neck breaker. Oh, the referee better get a hold of things. Slam down hard. Alexa Bliss is getting a serious beat. She goes for the cover. One. How did she kick out? Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. She goes down hard. That'll leave a mark. Vicious strike. And it's Alexa Bliss with the reversal. Going for the cover. One. Two. Where is she finding the strength to continue? How in the world? Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. Yeah, she's getting after it. Showing great energy. When she gets in attack mode, look out. Alexa Bliss is in position. Oh man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Nia Jax. Oh, 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 oh what a leg drop. Oh, makes my stomach hurt. That's it. That's what she needed. Sit out, jawbreaker! You can pick up your teeth in the third row. She goes for the cover. One, two, digging deep for a kick out. It's going to take more than that. Quick thinking by Nia Jax. Nailed it. Here we go with Nia Jax. Ooh, what impact. What a comeback. Nia Jax might have it right here. Two, three. Nia Jax has done it. Well, Falls Count Anywhere matches never disappoint, and this one was no exception.
That's a woman on a mission. Man, oh man, look at that. Look at her go. And that's exactly how she wanted to end this thing. Here is your winner, Nia Jax. Big win despite absorbing a huge amount of punishment there. Few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count. Guys, I have to say, that was an amazing match. Oh, man. The excitement level just went through the roof in this arena. One half a team extreme! The charismatic enigma about to grace the WWE Universe with his presence. Making his way to the ring from Cameron, North Carolina, weighing in at 225 pounds, Jeff Hardy! A true daredevil in every sense of the word, Jeff Hardy is immune to fear. Synonymous with tag team title reigns, a former United States champion, former world heavyweight champion. And what's amazing to think about, guys, is that the career of Jeff Hardy started at just the young age of 16 when he made his WWE. superstars WWE has ever known and not only because he's a world-renowned striker maybe the best in the whole business you are looking at a master of mind games a psychological warrior some might say those mind games that sinister like attitude represents the true personality of Shinsuke Nakamura a man who feels he has freed himself from the weight of the WWE. It took some time for Shinsuke Nakamura to finally earn gold on the main roster in WWE, but he did so in emphatic fashion when he beat Jeff Hardy to become United States Champion. Uh, emphatic? I'd say it was pathetic to see Nakamura steal the United States title by hitting Jeff Hardy with a low blow at Extreme Rules. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. Oh, man. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. Byron was just ragging on Shinsuke Nakamura for his tactics against Jeff Hardy. The charismatic enigma should have scouted Nakamura and should have known to watch out for that move. That's why I pledge allegiance to the United States oh, of Knock America. Stop. Okay, they're scouting a legal move, but the cheap shot artist hit that low blow before the match even started, Corey. You know that Jeff Hardy has been replaying that six second loss going into this match. Oh no, we know what this is. Is he done? How'd he do that? I don't know, Michael, but good thing. I don't think he could have taken much more of that. Elbow drop with authority. Fireman's carry. This doesn't look good, Corey. Couldn't agree more, Cole. This has got trouble written all over it. 
Not looking good for Jeff Hardy there. Well, he knew this was going to be a fight heading into this one. He just has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get out of hand. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, Cole. Unceremoniously deposited down. He wants no part of the outside. Hooked up. Back suplex. If I was Shinsuke, I'd rein in the antics a little bit. Not where he wants to be right now. Hey, he got himself into this mess. He's got to get himself out of it now. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. He wants no part of the outside. Shinsuke Nakamura with a nice reversal. A surprise reversal from Jeff Hardy. Oh, nasty impact. I'm not sure how much he has left. He kicks out before three. Might have slipped there, Cole. When this guy's on, look out. He's going for it all. He might have it. Look at this. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guy. Oh my God, he won the match. I can't believe it. He won the match. And here's another glance of these superstars in action. He really put on a great show. Here is your winner, Jeff Hardy. It's all over and Jeff Hardy stands victorious. Wow, when you pick up a pinfall victory over somebody like that, you've done something right. The arena is still buzzing over that great match. The baddest woman on the planet. It absolutely amazes me how quickly Ronda Rousey and seamlessly made her transition from the world of mixed martial arts to WWE. She improves each and every time she steps in the ring. A real natural. Making her way to the ring from Venice Beach, California, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Listen to this place. They're going nuts. From Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Natalia. Product of the Hart family dungeon carrying on the legacy of the legendary Hart family in sports entertainment. Natalia always 
ready to handle things inside the ring. Now the daughter of Jim the Animal Nightheart, the niece of WWE Hall of Famer Bret the Hitman Hart. Got the power of her father and the finesse of her uncle. Maybe the most respected superstar in the entire women's division. There's a lot of pride on the line between these two athletes tonight. Two of the proudest athletes we have ever seen in WWE. Harsh impact. What a stomp. Good grief. Incredible power. Wow, what a vertical suplex. Boom, what impact. Oh, man, right to the R. Hyper extend your elbow. Natalia's version of the sharpshooter taught to her by her uncle, WWE Hall of Famer Brent. Hitman Hart. She goes for the cover. Digging deep for a kick out. Not yet. Too early. Definitely not where you want to be right now. Gotta find a way to get out of this, Michael. Look at this. And she kicks out with relative ease. She's still in this one. Natalia's certainly learned this business from some of the best. When the Queen of Hearts takes that first step and turns over her opponent, the Sharpshooter's locked in, which means it's all over for Natalia's adversary. The Sharpshooter is one of the most famous finishing maneuvers in sports entertainment. All it takes is seeing Natalia slap the submission on an opponent to see why. Things starting to go the other way for her. This is not how she drew this one up. If you're worried about her now, you haven't seen many of her matches. She can withstand so much more oh. punishment than this. Point of the elbow, nailed it. Avoids trouble there. Oh, this is not good at all. The... Only one place to go when you're stuck in the fireman's carry. Yeah, down. And I can tell you it's not a pleasant trip. Look at her go. I'm not so sure Natalia should be strutting around like this. At least not yet. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. Natalia strikes with Natty by nature. This could be it. And she kicks out too soon. She is on fire. She might have it. Eludes that one. She better do something fast. And she escapes the submission. Not a lot of people can break out of that one, Michael. Natalia beginning to stumble a bit. Momentum clearly not on her side right now, fellas. It looks to me, guys, like she may have underestimated her opponent here tonight. And now she's paying for it. And this might be beautiful technique. But is it enough to end it? Can she end it here? Digging deep for a kick out. It's going to take more than that to keep her down. Ronda Rousey's done playing. Boom! <laughs> there it is. You gotta believe this one's over. I do not like Natalia's chances here, guys. Ah, oh, 
right, she gets out of it. She has renewed life now, Michael. Ooh-wee. This might be it. Oh, my. She's looking at it. I do not like Natalia's chances here, guys. Had a plan and executed it. I think she's trying to prove a point here. Ronda Rousey's done playing. She looks for it once again. Samoan drop. I do not like Natalia. There's a pin now. This singles match has come to an end. Wow. Now let's take a look back at these ladies in action. She's taking care of business. That's a woman on a mission. Look at her go. And so it goes. Here is your winner, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. It's all over, and Ronda Rousey stands victorious. I got a feeling we're going to be talking about her for a long time to come. What a great night it's been. Thank you for tuning in. We'll see you next time.